Malte Gjosef Muscati Lund Kellu laqa għasira unek fitrib li mal Preministru ċdijt li bjane zenaj Preministru li għadu muħix ufficialment konfermantu li jmeċċi il-Gvern ta' għada nazjonali għek kif maħbul ma' Nazjonit Unit il-Lura f-Dicembru Nizzew ċmeċċijat kelmu fuq diversi suġġetti Fostom il-domanda għawija li għaw bixxerġaw jinfetħu il-servizzi diplomatiċi Maldine ġewa tripli Pero Dr. Muscat għan li li bixxi sirdan dirit l-ewwel t-muskurata il-sigurta ta' diplomatiċi Maldine Umma t-kelmu kol fuq l-importanza li ġu stabiliti mil-ġdid rabtiet kumerċiali bejn il-sewġ paħizi il-suġġent ta' l-immigrazzjoni il-legali l-Primministru l-Bjan tenna u kol iċxaw għatijaw li malajr kem jistajku unjerġaw jibdew il-titirit diretti bejn Malta u l-Libja Il-baħt il-diplomasija il-Maltija il-Libja The return of the diplomatic, the Maltese diplomatic mission and embassy and diplomats to Libya. To ensure their safety and their security in Libya. And the possibility of returning flights between Libya and Malta in the near future. I think it's obvious that we want to re-establish our diplomatic representation here. The issue, as explained to the Prime Minister, is one that we want to ensure the safety of our diplomats and that we also want to have um, to plan ahead on uh, the, issuance, the, the issuance of visas, the way it will be managed, the way things need to be um, um, Problems need to be identified and solutions need to be uh, forecasted beforehand. So my answer is yes, we want to re-establish um, our <coughs> diplomatic presence here with the prerequisite of safety and security. So the first step will obviously be the swearing in of uh, the government, the government going into its respective ministries and then there will be a natural process that will take place.